One of the best tools on our site is the sizing guide. And you'll see that you can access it either up here from the nav bar or down here on the shortcuts tab. We'll just click this tab right here. And you'll see that it takes us to a seven step calculator. One of the very best uses of this tool is to use it to determine the smallest enclosure you can get. In order to find the smallest enclosure, you have to find the smallest device. So let's see how that works for us here. We know we need an RP, so let's select that here. We will say that it'll be a six inch device. And we want to leave these two fields unchecked so that we can do a bit of shopping. We'll also select NRS as a valve shutoff because we're going to assume it's a domestic line. Because 12 inches is the clearance on most devices in the United States, we'll use that there as well. So we hit search and we get these results. And as you see, they're sorted by manufacturer and model number over in these columns here. Now the secret to using this to find the smallest solution is this column here, cubic volume. It shows the size of enclosure required for each device. So perhaps you as a designer are fond of the Watts line. Looking through the list, you see the 909 displayed here. It happens to fit in our 600 AL. So we click on that and we can see a picture of the 600 AL along with the dimensions and the pricing of this model. You can also see the actual Watts 909 inside our 600 AL. This is available in plan and elevation views, so you can drop it right into your plans. What other Watts devices might we be able to choose that provide the same plumbing solution with a smaller visual envelope? We see on our solutions list that Watts makes a 957N, and that device goes in our 200DAL. The 957N is among the new class of devices that are much lower profile. In fact, this enclosure is only 30 by 48 and 40 inches tall. Here's the device in plan and elevation view. Perhaps you're a Wilkins advocate and would like to see what choices are available for you. Their 375 model is also the 600 AL, which we've already seen. The next generation low profile model for Wilkins is called the 475. And here's the safety cover enclosure for that device, the 800 LU880. It's 44 inches square and 52 inches tall. Another excellent brand out there is Apollo, also known as Combraco. Let's look at their 6-inch RP solution. The RP4A fits in our 400 AL, roughly a 100,000 cubic inch enclosure. Alternatively, Apollo's next generation solution, the RP4AN, resides in our 400 TLU880 AL solution. This enclosure is just 36 inches square and 44 inches tall, a roughly 57,000 cubic inch enclosure. And here it is in elevation and plan view. Of course, we're happy to provide the AutoCAD for these files as well. Just give us a call. I hope this helps explain our new sizing guide and that you're able to make great use of it. Thanks again.